Hello and welcome to MCTV's first It Takes Two of 2018. Our show reveals the creativity, smarts, and skills of couples, teammates, siblings, roommates, and best friends. Tonight, one team will prove that it takes two to get through our three rounds victorious. I'm your host, Jamie Cornelia, and tonight we have a matchup between friends. I'm joined by team Not Fast But Furious, Katie and Brianna, and team Masshole, Zach and Teresa. <laughs> Let's get to know our teams. So, you have a very interesting team name. Yes. Can you uh, describe that for me? Um, we're both from Massachusetts, and we're both massholes. <laughs> um, yeah. It's just the way we drive, I guess. But yeah, I guess. Drivers um, from New Jersey are pretty scary, too. Maybe it's just the whole, like, Northeast. Yeah. Probably. Yeah, but I think Massachusetts in general is just, like, some really pretty bad drivers. Yeah. <laughs> it's okay, we're good drivers. Yeah. We're the good mass holders. Okay. <laughs> so how long have you two known each other? Um, a year, a little over a year. Freshman year. Yeah. From the beginning of freshman year? Yeah, yeah. Danny introduced us. Danny Horviak introduced us. Nice so, little shout out. Yeah, nice little shout out to you, Danny. Hi. <laughs> okay. Hi. Lovely. And now we have team, not fast but furious, <laughs> Katie Brianna. So how did you come up with that team name? Um. Well, we're not fast, but we are furious. <laughs> this is true. We're definitely not built for speed, yeah. but like, we we're come out of the yeah. yeah. You know, All right. exercising is lame, so. So how long have you two known each other? We met at the beginning of the year. We were housemates. Oh, but you didn't know each other before. No. What's it like living with each other? Wonderful. <laughs> Actually, really good. We, yeah. we connect around 4 a.m. when you know yeah. everyone comes home from going out and eat pizza and talk about physics. It's a good time. Yeah, that's yeah. real fun. All she right. tells me about science things. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect. So now that we've met our contestants, it's time for the games to begin. For our first round, we will be playing Know Your Boo. This game tests how well you know your partner. First, Katie and Teresa will be asked three questions about their partners. They will have to quickly write down answers on the provided whiteboards. After time is up, I'll ask their partners for the correct answer and then have them reveal what they each wrote. Two points will be rewarded for each correct answer. So I'm going to ask that Brianna and Teresa switch seats. Okay. <laughs> I, got this. I think we do. I hope we do. Horrible pressure. We both went the same way. That's fine. <laughs> we just have to so. be better than Ben and John. <laughs> okay. Oh, cool. thank you. It's fine. It's fine. Yes. Okay. So, for the first question, what type of car do you drive? What, or your partner? <laughs> I hope you both know what types of cars you drive. I hope yeah. so. How many cars have you had? Just one or more than one? Two. 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 Well, well I'm still on my first. <laughs> it's trusty, so I'm interested to see. All right, you ready? OK. Brianna, what type of car do you drive? A Hyundai Sonata. <laughs> a Mazda. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Zach? Also a Hyundai Sonata. Oh, wow. I said white Honda Civic model. <laughs> <laughs> you Civic. went down to the model. <laughs> that is really impressive. It is white, though. It, it is. is. All right. <laughs> That's good. Do you know the color of Brianna's car? It's blue, right? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. All right. We know colors, not yeah. car types. We yeah. have an eraser, Katie, if you'd like. Oh, yeah. yeah. Here you go. <laughs> <laughs> All right. So for our second question, this one's a little out there, but if you were to compete in the Winter Olympics, which sport would it be? Uh oh. <laughs> so we have skating, skiing, snowboarding, bobsled. Luge. Um, I was looking at this the other week. Ice hockey. There's one. Um, 
think that's it. There's not as many in the, in the winter games. Mm, there's there's the definitely some I'm forgetting. But, all right, you ready? I think so. Brianna, if you could compete in a winter Olympic sport, what would it be? Definitely curling. Oh, yes! <laughs> <laughs> that was one that I left off. Perfect. Okay. And Zach, if you could compete in an Olympic sport, what would it be? I'm gonna say bobsledding. Oh, I said skiing, question mark. <laughs> <laughs> bobsledding would be fun. Would you join the Jamaican team? would be fun. Team? They're pretty famous. Amazing. Maybe. Who knows? Uh -oh. All right. So, team not fast but furious, you got two points on the board. We're doing good. That's okay, we so, got it. <laughs> you got, yes, each question is two points. Yeah. All right, Groundhog Day is on Friday. Do you think that Puxatawney Phil will see his shadow this year? He sees his shadow six more weeks of winter. Otherwise, we get an early spring. And I'm really hoping for warm weather. Anybody else? Yeah, definitely. Me too. All right. So, have you got your answers? Will he see his shadow? I don't think so. Woo! <laughs> yes. Longer winter. Zach? I think so. Oh my god, yeah! <laughs> We're going to be optimistic. All right. All right. So, team, not fast. But Furious, you've got four points, and Team Masshole, you have two <laughs> points. So now it's time to switch the boards, okay, okay. and your partner will be asked three questions. Okay. Thank you for consolidating it so nicely. Thank you. Okay. So, here is our first question. What is your favorite national holiday? Now I'm going with not religious ones, but your Labor Days, your Memorial Days, your Martin Luther King Day, Veterans Day. What else have we got? Um, Columbus Day. That's another, that's another one in there. These are the random holidays. Groundhog's Day, but just don't get appreciated. Oh. So, <laughs> have you thought of one? Um, Thanksgiving. That's not. That's not. Oh, sorry. <laughs> okay. I'm, uh, I'm, I'm picking the weird. Ones. St. Patrick's Day. Oh! Wow. All right. Very nice. Wow. Well. <laughs> All right. Teresa. Um, I think I'm going to have to go with April Fool's Day. Oh. Uh, no. Fourth oh, of July. I like that one, too. Oh, yeah. man. Oh, There's well. a lot of holidays in there. <laughs> there are a lot of That was a good one, though. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> April Fool's is Easter this year. Oh, yeah. Oh, my God. Mm -hmm. It is. Wow. It'll be a tricky day. Oh. Ooh. All right. <laughs> Next question. And this is simple. High School Musical, one, two, or three. And now I'm asking, are you all in this together? <laughs> oh. <laughs> this, is, this is a tough one. You've got the classic in the first one. Yeah. As, as our director, Kevin, has said, you got to get your head in the game. <laughs> you got to get your, get your head in the game. It's a lot of good songs. You got any favorite songs? My favorite song? Um, oh, high School Musical. Status Quo. Oh, that's a good one. It's a dramatic one. Yeah, it's a good one. Oh, so I'm trying to think. What was... There's a lot of good ones. There, there are a lot of good ones. Yeah. I did like Get Your Head in the Game, though. That was nah, a great one. That's a good one, too. That's a great All one. All right. Katie, what is your favorite high school musical? Definitely three. <laughs> oh, no. It one. better be. <laughs> I guess we know what three is. <laughs> All right. Teresa. My favorite one is the second one. Oh, I haven't seen them so <laughs> the first one. <laughs> what were you doing as a nine-year-old child in 2006? Watching Nickelodeon. Oh. oh. <laughs> All right, Zach, your assignment for tonight is to watch High School Musical. It's on Netflix. Fine. It's a classic. <laughs> I'd recommend watching with other people who will sing along and annoy you. Okay. All right, next one. The Super Bowl is this Sunday. Are you rooting for the Patriots or the Eagles? This is too easy. <laughs> Do you oh. know? <laughs> Do you know who you're rooting for? No. <laughs> well, you're okay, gonna have I'll, to pick one. I'll pick one. Okay. <laughs> Are you ready? Yeah. Are you um, ready? Oh, can I answer? Yeah. Okay. Eagles. <gasps> Woo! Ooh. Ooh. Okay. Ooh. <laughs> um, the Patriots. <laughs> Team Masshole for. <laughs> well, yes, that makes sense. Okay. So, for you guys got two right this round and two right the last, last round. So you have a total of eight, and Team Masshole has a total of four. But we're just getting started, <laughs> so we're gonna move on to round two. All 
Our second round is called Teamwork Makes a Dream Work. This round will test your communication skills. One person on each team will get a stack of cards with boxed words on them. One player will read the word and then give clues to help their partner guess. On the bottom of each card are a few words that cannot be used for the clues. For each word guessed correctly, one point will be awarded for each team. So say the word, the boxed word was Cinderella. You can't say like glass slipper or I don't know, so pumpkin or something. Stuff. Yeah, the more, yeah, you have to really search. But the category for these cards is the um, award show season. Ooh. So we have a mix of the Grammys, we have a mix of like Oscars, Golden Globes. It's not like who won this award, it's people, some songs, which if you can only hum the song, you can't say the lyrics. So if it's a song, okay? All right, who wants to go first? <laughs> go, or, okay. you wanna, I don't care, you go first. <laughs> okay, who wants okay. to read uh, and I give clues? You volunteered okay. us. Okay. <laughs> so, you will have a minute and a half. No. Mm, no. Okay. <laughs> All right. Oh, I gave you the wrong card. <laughs> <laughs> yep, here we go. Okay. Ready, set, go. Okay, he has an album called 444. Um, married to uh, the Queen. Jay-Z? Yeah. Um, this is a song that was like the number one song of the summer this year. Despacito. Yeah. Um, oh, he like cleaned up at the Grammys this year. One best album. Has curly hair. He's 5'4". Bruno <laughs> Mars. Yeah. Um, Katie no celebrity. Uh, so this person was, had a big lawsuit recently with someone named Dr. Luke. Kesha. Yeah. Um, oh, this is a show that's like kind of a thriller and everyone loves it and it's got like four little kids in it. And there's a Scandal. cop that, uh, <laughs> uh, the demogor- oh! <sighs> um, he's in- uh, no, I can't do it. Um, oh, sh she's old and Donald Trump said she was like one of the most underrated- overrated actors ever. Meryl Streep. Yeah. Um, oh, this is- no. <laughs> um, these people, it's a band and they are like an activity that you do with 30 seconds. Times. And you like pass around a cigarette, maybe that's, you know. <laughs> okay. Um, no. Um, oh, this is. It was a challenge, and you like run, and then you turn really fast, and it's also a movie. Fifteen. Uh, it's about racism. Uh, I don't watch films. Uh, the blank blank challenge. What? What? I got nothing. You can go through the ones you skipped if you want. Uh, oh, I, you're out. Sorry. Shoot. Okay. Get out. Okay. Get out. You missed, well, Stranger Things, you said Demogorgon. Uh, yeah, sorry. <laughs> I was thinking you could say Waffles, Eggos. Oh, I would have known Egg. Egg. Yeah. Um, Denzel Washington. Like, you know who he is, but yeah, it's I don't hard know how to, to describe him. him. Shape of Water is you had a hard, I, I don't, only keep I don't nominated one. Media, so you had a hard time with me. <laughs> but if you didn't see it, I don't know how you describe it. Baby Driver. I didn't see that. Oh, that was like a movie. Oh, uh, but you couldn't say Ansel Elgort. Ansel's such a cutie. And uh, <laughs> when she was describing cigarettes, she meant the chain smokers. <laughs> I tried to describe the activity rather than the <laughs> And then Harrison Ford. The American classic, but you couldn't say Hansel or, or Indiana Jones. Yeah, that Jones. was tricky. Mm. So, all right, <laughs> you got one, two, three, four, five. Because you add five four? points, so you have a total of thirteen. Now, Team Masshole, who's reading? <laughs> they didn't think about this. I oh, I don't know. So much pressure either way. I guess I'll read. Just read? <laughs> All right. Sure. Let me know when you're ready. Can I look at them now? Right. You, yeah. Okay. All right. Begin. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> We're off to a good start. The song, no, I'm going to put that one wrong. Oh, um, newspaper. The Post? Yeah. Oh, got it. Uh, no, I'm going to go back to that oh one. Oh, my God, Zach. <laughs> uh, it's like the shape of water. Well, they can't say the word that's oh, in it. Shit. Oh, shit. Sorry, Kevin. <laughs> um, it's on NBC. It's a show about a family. The, the, uh, modern Family? No, no, that's ABC. Oh, wait. NBC? Yeah. Can you give me more? <laughs> uh, won a lot of Emmys. I, I don't know. 
Um, that music video that I had to make and it took forever to do and I hate the song now. Oh, Believer. Yeah. You got 15 minutes. My Seconds. favorite movie. <laughs> Seconds. I'm sorry. Oh my god, wait. My favorite movie. Believer! I knew it. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah, I'm bad. I'm sorry. <laughs> well, yeah, I should have said shape, but it was shape of you, so you can't do that. What else? Oh, you saved Margot Robbie. Yeah, I was gonna oh. that. Lord, I'm not really sure how you describe her, but yeah, I don't know. You have Khalid. The Big Sick was coming up, and oh. Star Wars. Oh man. And you skipped Childish Gambino, Kendrick no Lamar. Idea. This is us. Was the oh, I've never seen that show. Yeah. Ooh. <laughs> it's I've, heard of, I've heard of it. I just recommend. Yeah. So <laughs> I think we got three. <laughs> got Lady Bird, Imagine Dragons, and The Post. So you have a yeah, total of awesome. seven. <laughs> you guys yeah. have a total yeah. of 13. <laughs> but w you can have. We have <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Points are worth. Cards are worth two points in the third round. So you could have a chance to come back. So, we're gonna move on to round three. <laughs> Ready? Yeah. Mm -hmm. All right, perfect. Okay. Welcome to round three, which we like to call In It To Win It. This is the last chance for our teams to score, so it's time to make it count. Our teams will be playing a charades challenge. Each team will be given 90 seconds to act out and get through as many cards as possible. While acting out a word, no talking is allowed. For each correct answer, teams will be awarded two points. So, Katie, you can pick up your cards and let me know when you're ready. Okay. You ready? Yeah, I'm ready. Set, go. Okay. Basketball. No. Shooting. Yeah. Um. Punching. Boxing. Yeah. Um. I forgot to mention their Olympic sports. Curling. <laughs> um. Ice skating. Yeah. Figure skating. Yeah. Um. Skiing. Oh, snowboarding. Snowboarding. Yeah. Um. Gymnastics. No. Swimming. Diving. Yeah. <laughs> Got 30 seconds. Oh. Basketball. <laughs> um. <laughs> Volleyball. Yeah. Archery. Yeah. Golf. Wow. <laughs> Horseback riding? No. <laughs> <laughs> you got 30 seconds left. Uh, oh. Cycling? Bicycle. Yeah. Wow. Ooh. You did it in a minute and you got them all. <laughs> so you got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So you added 20 points to your score, so you have a total of 33. So you ready, Team Masshole? <laughs> all right. Wow. We'll try this. Yeah, or at least scoot them to the side in case they throw them as well. Thank you. You can hire Katie, she's great. Okay. You're gonna be acting, she's Teresa? So good. All right. Like well, here you go. Okay. All right, are you Olymp ready? Yes. Olympic sports. Ready Olympic ever. sports. Okay. All right. Do, we, do I go? You can go now. Okay. Uh, horse equestrian? Yes. I don't know how to do that one. Um, oh, yeah. Gymnastics? Yes. Very nice. Um, <laughs> okay. I'll come back to that one. Um, uh, uh, Ice skating? Hockey? Yes. <laughs> I, oh, wait. Uh, I think, I don't know. No, never mind. I don't know what that sport is. <laughs> oh. Fencing. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, I don't know. OK. Um, oh. Uh, wait, <laughs> I'm not doing this is that roller right. derby? What? Roller derby? 
No. We've got uh, 30 uh, seconds I can't do left. Uh, Roll of Duty's oh. not in the Olympics. Oh. <laughs> Is that one fencing? Yes. <laughs> there we go. Uh, oh. One weightlifting. Yes. <laughs> All right. Swimming? Yes. And then, what were the ones that you didn't get? <laughs> we lost them. <laughs> you, you, you made, all right. I might have lost them. Oh, good. wait. No, I can't Want do that one. <laughs> okay. <laughs> what was it? What were Bomb some of sledding? these? Oh. I don't know how to do that one. Like, do I just, That like, was the sport he was in. Uh, yeah. He got gymnastics, lovely. Yes. <laughs> stick the landing. Yes, Weightlifting, thanks. swimming, fencing. Oh, the other one was table tennis. <laughs> ah, like... speed skating. Oh, I, yeah. I, I think I saw the, the form. Yeah, I tried. I forgot what the form was. I was like, wait, no. <laughs> I'm uncoordinated. Skiing, pole vaulting. I didn't uh, know that one. I wouldn't have gotten it. I <laughs> you got hockey. Now I'm dropping the cards. <laughs> and you got equestrian. Okay, I didn't even keep track of how many you got. I, we um, anyway. Yeah, we lost. It's fine. <laughs> they got 12 points, so you have a total of 19. Team, 19. not fast but furious, are champions. You can come back out. You had a total of 33. It was oh. very impressive. Look at job. We haven't had anybody who's gotten all of the charades yet, so congratulations. Thank you to both teams for a fun and competitive game. This has been a great battle of friends. I'm Jamie Cadelia, and thanks for watching It Takes Two. Good night. <laughs>